Hey, hey, hey! It's Dominionation! Looks like Bridge Fool's Gold opening for Shearer. And we got Shelters here. Which benefits the trashing player. Silver. I don't understand that. No, sir, not one bit. Pillage. It's a bit early for a pillage. Just gonna get more fool's golds, right? Uh, I could get a quarry and a fool's gold. How about that? And here, I shall get fool's gold. And here I'll get another quarry and another fool's gold. When you're playing against, um. So when you're try when you're contesting the fool's golds, then you want to get all of them all right away. I guess the pillage helps you get to grand market, but you know, fool's golds help with that too. Alrighty, and just gonna get lots of fool's golds, and you'll kill my bridge surely, and I will get a grand market, I suppose. And it is indeed irksome that I lost the bridge there. Um, but not game-endingly so. And... Bridge. And actions by Fool's Gold. My opponent will soon see that having lots and lots of fool's gold is pretty much the end for him. Uncontested fool's gold is just absurdly strong. And with Grand Market, are you going to block the Grand Market? Okay, so I think that means I can get a Grand Market and a Fool's Gold. Which I will do very gladly. I guess it might be time for Nobles or something. I don't know, I'll just stick with the Grand Markets. Two grand markets. And three buys, huh? So that's two grand markets in the last fool's gold. My opponent is. So I just. Uh, piles are really, really low. Um, but uh, I think that puts me way up on points, so I'm not too worried about it. Let's see. Shall I get the nobles? I'll get the double estate. I see stars, and you win. Okay, so I was not minding piles. 
Um, let's see, so that was a really quick game. Uh, I should have gotten some nobles to stop the, or I don't know, at least held off on that last fool's gold or something. Um, yeah, not mining piles. Those eight nobles put them over the edge. Uh, thanks for watching.